Okay, for my 20% time, um, me and Jennifer did Skinny America, and we started on um, October 21st, and it was only for a month, because that was how much the pass would do, and we ended on November 21st, because of Thanksgiving, like, because you don't want to go to Thanksgiving and be rude and not eat, you know, that's, my family would take it personally, because they just eat, but, um, we knew it would be very hard because of, like, we, we've set these goals before, like, you know, every person has. And, like, maybe it's your New Year's resolution. And you don't accomplish it, you know? You're like, you say you're going to lose weight. You say you're going to get stronger. But you don't because you're lazy, you know? And um, we did find some motivation to do it, but obviously not enough. Um, it was... I thought it was hard because of schoolwork and stuff, and I kind of struggled in that. But um, I managed to do it because I, um, you know, I would do schoolwork first. Like I get home and just do that. And even though it killed me, I still did it. Um, we sent plenty of like requests and messages, and we went to classes and we went to the rec center. We talked to the rec center. We talked to the fitness director and the gym director, and he said we can play basketball and all that stuff. And, um, especially the PE teachers here, they helped us a lot. Well, at the high school, not here. But, um, they helped us a lot. And Miss Beth, she went through, like, you know, she was at her prep hour, and she could have been gone and stuff, but she was helping us with testing our tri-fit thing, tri-fitness. And we improved, I would say, quite a bit because, like, it's hard, you know, it's hard to lose weight and it's hard to, you know, do that, but we've managed and we didn't lose as much weight as we'd like to, but, you know, we don't need to be too fixed like some people are and think they need to be, you know, it's, like, everyone likes thick girls nowadays, just not thick, thick, so don't get out of control, girls. But, um, in gym class, Jennifer didn't have it, but I did, and I improved a lot in my push-ups and in my sit-ups, and that's good because I knew it was from this class and from this project, and that, I don't know, that was just a good feeling because I was really in shape, and then I got a bad injury, and then I just wasn't, you know, doing anything anymore because I used to race, and that's, I think that's sad. And, like, it was good to know that I could do it again. And so, that's what I like about this. Um, in this class, or in this project, I learned a lot. I learned that if you really, really want to do something, and you want to set a high goal, you have to want it. Like, you have to think you're going to fall through with it. And you have to want everything about it. Like, you want to be skinny. And, I, I don't know. I was... I don't know. I think I was stressed out and stuff that I just wanted to eat, and that's why I think it is. You know, I didn't reach the goals I like to, but I reached, you know, some lower ones that I had set for myself also. Because you can't set a high goal and expect you're going to do it, because maybe you won't. Um, and I think I would do this again. I really would. And I think I'm actually starting to right now. Because... You know, to know, like, the word failure, like, it just, it's it's just deadly, I think. And, you know, I grew up to learn to never fail. And, um, I am starting it right now. And I'm doing a little yogurt things and all that. But it's also, I want it, you know. And it is a mini English revolution, but I want it. And I've kept it for 17 days. <laughs> but, um, that's pretty much my speed.